When I was working as a Microsoft team support engineer, there used to be one general conclusion we had, and that was the fact that you cannot copy the content of um, a team from one team to the other, or you cannot even copy a channel from a team to the other. So today I'm happy to tell you that with ShareGit, you can actually comfortably copy the contents of a team you can copy the, the standard channel private channel the team's permission the tabs the apps the planner the files the folder and the associated sharepoint site from one team to the other comfortably within seconds so today i just want us to build or create a new team from scratch and we're just going to call that um, just going to call that migration so let's just call that migration and then it's going to be a private team and the first channel there let's just call it copy copy channel which was supposed to be the um, general channel but now you have option to name it right so that is it without wasting much uh, much of our time we just hit on create and then this is just going to create for us a new team without any member and I'm not even interested in getting members out or into this team for now so I'm just going to click on skip and then I have the channel bearing copy channel here and there is nothing inside of it if you check the files there's nothing there because the team is just a fresh team without anything inside of it so the essence of this video is for me to copy a channel from an existing team that has content inside of it and copy it right into the migration team that we just created so i'll bring up my share gate here on the screen so if i come to share gate come to explore so if you come to explore you're going to see the tenant that is connected here which is pillars concept tenant at this time so i'll just hit on copy so if i hit on copy i'm going to see copy team so i'll hit on copy team and then this will tell me which team i want to copy from so if i check the job ready um, training project I have five channels and one of those channels is test copy file right so I'll just hit on test copy file the, the reason is because inside of the test copy file I have um, I have some files that are here already in this channel right so if you want me to show you I can show you that before we move on so let me just drag this to the other screen first and then I'm talking about uh, pillars concepts job ready training so if I come here I'll have test copy file and inside of this channel I have files here let me just show you what that is before we move on so I have master CV and I have pictures here inside of the test copy file right so I'm moving it right into the migration okay so let me just move this here and then I'll expand this so I'm going to move this test copy file and I'll hit on continue to destination so if I do this here it's going to be blank out for me until I have to select the channel which I want to I mean the tenant which I want to carry out this activity so if I wanted to ma make this like um, a cross tenant uh, migration I'm going to hit on the add connector I mean add connection to add the other tenant but in this particular video we are going to be concentrating on doing this within pillars concept just moving it from one team to the other not actually moving copying it from one um one team to the other so i'll click on here to just see the channel that i've selected and here it's just going to say do you want to copy as a team or do you want to copy channel into an existing team so i'll just click on copy channel into an existing team for copy as a team i'm going to do that in another video so i'll just hit on this to see which team do i want to copy this into i want to copy it into migration and this is migration here so i'll just hit on it and then it's picked it up and i'll just say start copy so if i say start copy now this is going to start moving that file there but before then if i come to migration <coughs> again there is nothing like um, test copy here right it's just copy channel that we have there so that's fine so what happens now is this process is on so it's going to take some minutes because this the content of this channel has some videos and some text files inside of it so it's just moving it and it's still the processing is still on and there is only one warning and it's at one percent completion and you can see the files are moving mp4 files are moving and yes they are just ongoing so i'm going to pause this video for a while and then we would see how it will come to this team after some seconds so i'm just going to refresh this channel i mean this uh, browser and see if there is any changes already because a lot of files are should be moving by this time
okay so right now i can see 11 successes here 16 successes and it keep counting zero warnings and one error 36 34 now and it's just keep moving and counting so i'm going to look at what has come in already for me here in um, migration team and then there is nothing obviously in the copy channel but the test copy file is here and i should expect to see some files already moved into this place do not complete it yes because i have 34 successes three warnings and if i check master cv folder i should see this content here so if i come back to this place um if i come back here so i should see pictures also showing up some you know some content inside of it you can see these ones are all migrated now so it is showing successful for me from the share gate end so i'm just going to pull it up to this other screen so that you can see the completion that it is showing here so look at it it's saying 64 items copied successfully and then i have three warnings and one error so if you click on view details then you're going to see the details here so for the error i see that it is duplicate of one particular so an, an unexpected error occurred the site url parameter with a value in the OneNote tab configuration is not valid URL. So this is one common error that I see, but it does not stop anything. But if you have more details about this error, of course, please just share it on the channel and I mean on the comment section and I'll be happy to learn from you on this. So if you look at this, you can see all success, just three warnings. And this is all that you have seen here, successful 69 results. I mean, if you bring up this one to this side and you want to compare what is present in the source, location and the destination location you would find out that they are all the same and you can decide to click on this to watch it so this is me just moving the content of i mean a complete channel from a particular existing um team to another newly created team so this is beautiful this is wonderful if you know you like this content please hit on the like button i'm going to play a lot with share gates including tenant to tenant migration sharepoint from on-prem migration to the sharepoint online and then a lot of other things that i can do with the share gate so let me know if you the content you want me to do and i'll be happy to do that and if you've not subscribed to this channel yet please hit on the subscribe button thank you for your time and have a great day peace